Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Mary and I work with Dreamline Realty out of Charlotte, North Carolina. Today I am here to help you decide whether to move to Charlotte or not to Charlotte. Let's get into it. The first thing that comes to my mind whenever I talk about why I love living in Charlotte is the weather. The weather is amazing year round. Um, you know how you're supposed to have four seasons? Well, they really make themselves known in uh, Charlotte. During our summer, the temperatures can get up to 90 degrees and our winters can get pretty chilly. Uh, we see snow probably like once a year, once a, every two years, really just depends. But our um, fall and spring are so nice. They're so comfortable and it's just like crisp outside. It, it's the best. Another thing that I absolutely love about Charlotte is the variety of sport options that we have. Uh, obviously we have the Carolina Panthers, which will be making a comeback this season, mark my word. Um, we also have the Charlotte Knights, we have the Hornets, which is a basketball team, and we also have freaking ice hockey, which is so cool. I didn't think that I would enjoy it, but I went to one of their games and it was so cool. And also we have a new soccer team um, that plays in the same Bank of America stadium our Panthers play in. Also, Charlotte is home of racing. So if you are a race fan, there is always so much going on at the Speedway. Another thing that I really love about Charlotte is we are smack dab in the middle of the state. It is a perfect location, three and a half ish hours to Wilmington, which is our beach town. And then it is about two hours to Asheville, which is the mountains of North Carolina. Um, so it makes it really easy for day trips uh, or weekend trips. It's really the perfect location. The mountains in the fall especially are beautiful with all the fall colors and the crisp air. It just makes it so amazing. <laughs> there are numerous hiking trails, uh, lookouts, a lot of other things that I love about Charlotte is our airport is very convenient for obviously the people that live in Charlotte, but also people that live around Charlotte. It doesn't take too long to get there and it's pretty efficient. The nightlife in Charlotte is phenomenal and we also have an amazing amusement park. You've probably heard of it. It's called Carowinds. The last thing that I want to bring up is the White Water Center which has all kinds of activities for the whole family, including whitewater rafting. In my opinion, Charlotte is a great place to live, but it's not the best place for everybody. The biggest complaint I hear about Charlotte is traffic, and it's true. If you're wanting to stay within the city limits, you definitely have to learn to be okay with traffic. If you're working in Charlotte and you live right outside of Charlotte, you're still gonna have to be able to get over that 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. traffic because it does get very jammed. We'll be covering other areas right outside of Charlotte if you decide that you're not wanting to stay in the city limits. So make sure you're subscribed and leave us a comment on where you're thinking about moving and we would love Love to do a video on it. Another reason some people don't love living in Charlotte is because of how populated it has become. In 2000, there were roughly 577,000 people living within the city limits of Charlotte. 21 years later, that number has jumped to 880,000. So we are growing, but that's not always a bad thing. And if you don't want to be part of this big number, you're in luck. My team and I service all areas around Charlotte, which include a lot of smaller cities and towns where you don't have people with an arm's reach of your home. Two things before I leave you today. One, I hope this video showed you how amazing Charlotte is and it just solidified your choice in moving to Charlotte. Or two, now you're kind of reconsidering living within the city limits and you're kind of thinking that you want to live right outside of Charlotte where it's a slower pace of life, but you're also not too far away from the city. Either way, I would love to connect with you and kind of get to know your situation. All of my contact information is in the description below. You can shoot me a text, give me a call, or schedule a Zoom meeting. I would love to connect with you. Please give this video a like and have a great day.